I see this bloke walking along the street wearing a pink bow tie. It looks like a great pink butterfly attacking his neck. It is the silliest bow tie I have ever seen. What are you staring at, lad? says the bloke. He is in a bad mood. Your bow tie, I tell him. It is ridiculous. It looks like a pink vampire. Mina Harker's Journal, 30th of September. I am so glad that I hardly know how to contain myself. It is, I suppose, the reaction from the haunting fear which I have had that this terrible affair and the reopening of his old wound might act detrimentally on Jonathan. I saw him leave for Whitby with as brave a face as could, but I was sick with apprehension. There's white bread, brown bread, currant tea cake, one of them big curd tarts from Gregory's and a lot of cheese. And a little brown jug. You know what that is, don't you? Don't you? <laughs> well, I never did. A little brown jug's a drop of rum for your tea. They're getting right lively on it. You know what else is funny? Oh, you can lose everything so easily. He was the easiest thing to lose. But then my job, my family. The hardest thing was to learn that all of my achievements have been for nothing. If we shadows have offended, think but this, and all is mended. That you have but slumbered here, while these visions did appear. And this weak and idle theme, no more yielding but a dream. Gentles, do not reprehend. If you pardon, we will mend. And, as I am an honest puck, if we have an earned luck now to scape the serpent's tongue, we will make amends ere long. Else the puck a liar call. So good night unto you all. Give me your hands if we be friends, and Robin shall restore amends.